Well, hello everyone and welcome back here to Don't Starve or Are Lonesome because Bitlate is off doing really, really important things. I will be No, 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 let's, let's just not go down that route. Okay, we are in day 31, believe it or not. We are halfway through winter. Things are really, really cold and we are running out of some essential resources. And the most essential one of, of uh, the lot being grass. So what I'm planning on doing is doing an expedition down to here. Might not seem like going very far, but to be totally honest with you, in midwinter we may well freeze to death doing it. So what we're going to do is we're going to stock up with some meals here. I might take a quick run around the, the remaining traps before moving on. And then we're going to run down here and set up another campfire, probably down here somewhere. Hopefully before freezing to death. And then... The rest of the day, or the next day, if that takes us that long, we shall get all the grass from down here we can. And if possible, we'll explore, see if we can explore down this way and perhaps come back up this path. We need to get some uh, wood for fires anyway. Uh, so, let's crack on, shall we? Okay, just waiting for this last meal to cook. Yeah, mini, mini, mini. Thank you very much. Right. Quick run around the uh, the traps. There's nothing in them at the moment. Uh, there's Chester following us. Uh, where's my earmuffs? Have my earmuffs broken? It would appear that my earmuffs have broken. Well, that's an imminent opportune thing to happen. But we shall just have to uh, have to deal. Right, we're going to go get those trees and then head on south. There's the trees. Where's my axe? Uh, there it is. Oh, five percent left. That was really worth the effort of finding it. All right, give me a new axe. Thank you very much. All right, so one tree. Grab these. Get startled by the penguins because you know that's what they do. Let's get those stumps as well. Off the trot. There you go. Okay. Right. And here's loads and loads and loads of lovely grass. I'd say this is probably a good place. Let's have a quick look at the map. A little bit further. No, I think actually this will do nicely. Alright, let's get ourselves a fire down. So, build a fire pit there. There we go, that'll help re reheat our thermal stone. And we've still got plenty of time left, so what we'll do is we'll jump between the thermal stone and everything else. Just heat, uh, heating ourselves up, actually. Oh, I can never catch that thing. Uh, uh, that was its last use anyway, so never mind. Okay, right, uh, how are we work okay, it? We warmed up a little bit. Me and that boomerang just are not getting on. You've got to click exactly on the boomerang in order to stop it, and I wasn't doing that quite right. Never mind. Look at this lovely grass, this is excellent. Oh, and there's my earmuffs. I knew I had them. A little bit of heat, the sun's going down, so when it does, we'll duck back down to the campfire. It's going to be long nights of inactivity, I'm afraid, at the moment, but this is absolutely essential to our continued success. And quite frankly, I'm really happy with how far we've done. Now, day 31, middle of the winter, and that's really hard to get to. So, yeah, if we can get all the way through the winter, I would be really delighted. Okay. So, that's about half of that done. Let's just chuck a bit more heat into the thermal stone there. Okay, that's good. I've taken our selection of petals as well because we've run out of, uh, of a garland, which means our sanity is starting to drop. And if I can find one more petal, I want to make myself another garland because, quite honestly, Keeping our sanity up is important here. I think that 
may be our lot. Let's just have a quick look. Yeah, tomorrow we'll go round here back up if we can. Let's chuck a log onto the fire. I'm doing plenty of time yet. Let's just have a quick run down here. Our thermal stone is getting cold, so we're going to want to run back up quickly. But we should be alright for a minute. I just want to have an actual look here. To see if things carry on. Things do carry on. So there we go. There's our path tomorrow. We shall go around there and back up. But let's get back to the fire before we freeze. Here we go. And we'll chuck another log on that in a moment. Let's burn these pine cones. There we go. That gives us a bit more light and heat. So we got a whole stack of grass. We've got a little bit over. Now if we can get two stacks of grass, that will probably see us through the winter, which is marvellous. Have a quick look at the map. Okay, we've got all this. We've got all of this. There's a bit more grass around here. So that's where we'll head tomorrow. We'll head around back up and regroup back up here. Um, if we've got time, we'll probably go and get some spider silk, I should imagine. And should, should I suppose we could start looking over this way and getting resources here. I mean, certainly we could use a bit more wood. And there's a grasslands there I'd love to explore, but I don't think we really have the means to do so. I'm, if the beefalo are there, that would be perfect. Okay, right. right. I'm not going to be doing much for the rest of the day now, so I think what we'll do is we'll cut out here, and we shall come back in the morning. In the meantime, let's just do a little dance around the fire. Right. Okay. Okay, it is just about to hit morning, and as soon as it does, we're on our way. Okay, we want to make as much, as much, as much use of our time as possible today. We've got a lot of running to do, and if we me if we mess this up, this is it. We're dead. So. Yeah, we've got to get this right. I've got another fire. In fact, let's check this. Can I make... I can't make another fire pick because I don't have enough stone. But I've got another fire just in case we start to freeze. And I suppose this is actually a good opportunity to pick up some stone. So let's do that as well. I said pick up stone, not pick up penguin. Let's have that night. We might actually make it to summer. We might find a use for it. There we go. Okay, so... More grass. A couple more trees would be nice. Okay, that's going into a swamp. That's not what we want. Let's quick look on the map. Yeah, this is not going to be much use to us, but we will walk up here and go across, I think. So, and let's grab a couple more trees on the way. Oh, mushroom. Okay, thought that was a flower for a second. Okay, another tree. I'm running short on time, so I don't think I'm going to stop to pick up the stumps. But the wood is much appreciated. Okay, so let's just keep on heading north. Grab this grass. Sorry about that, had a phone call. So that grass, how are we doing? Okay, we've got a stack and a quarter. It's definitely not going to slip out. Considering how desperate we were for materials to start off with. We might as well grab these twigs on the way past. We are now getting fairly close to spring. Day 32, so eight days after this. Here we are back at the base. Let's go and grab ourselves a load of bunny. Spoiled seed. I don't think I've ever seen one of those before. Uh, 
there was a seed there, okay. Alright, so let's get this uh, stuff off of some meat. Actually, given the state of my rabbit earmuffs, let's make some more earmuffs. So we'll take a couple of these. Like that, put that trap back. And survival. No, it must be a power of that. So here we go. Happy earmuffs! Okay, but we'll wear the wearing out ones. Oh, this one's there. There we go. Like that. Oh, lost the trap there. Time to do something about that. But uh, let's get a bit of warmth into us first. Go right, get the fire going and eat a meal. That meat is dried, that's excellent. Okay, right, let's go and get the get these traps cleared. Fortunately we can replace these traps now. So let's make ourselves a couple of new traps. How many do we need? One, three by the looks of it. Two, sorry about the airplane in the background. I really wish I could do something about it. But when you say things like that on a public channel, people start getting very suspicious about you. So let's not, let's just pretend I didn't say anything there, okay? <laughs> okay, right. Oh, now that was the last of the trap. Okay, so there we go, the red of the crow. Get back here to the warmth. Nice. Okay, so. Didn't find any petals, so we'll put that back. We'll put that one back there. That's probably quite considerably lowered the quality there, but we'll we'll live. Okay. Harvest these drying racks. Like that. Okay, and now we can get some more meat on those to dry. I think we've been incredibly lucky this this time round with the, uh, the the dry and racks and the rabbit food and all that. So one of those, two of those, and our last monster meat. We'll sort that out in the morning. Get that cooking. Right, we've got plenty of food. I think that will do for the evening, to be honest with you. So I shall see you at the start of day 33. Okay, hello, welcome back. It is morning, day 33, so third day of our session. And during the night, I was having a look at the map and thinking about the things we need. And well, we do need silk. I think my first priority is to get hold of some flowers and in order to do that probably the best bet is to go into a new area so I'm thinking that we'll go down here and just see if we can there's probably not that much there but let's explore it anyway just in case there's a flower or two we need 12 flowers to make a garland we have 11 now there's a resurrection stone there and there's pig heads around resurrection stones and I don't think I ever took the leather. In fact let's check the uh, if, if, we ha if I have it it'll be in here somewhere. Not in that one and not in that one and we got one piece of silk and one rot in there. Interesting. Put those pine cones in there for later on. Oh, actually, you know what? I don't think we really need that many pine cones. Okay. So, pine cones are going to be needed. We've got loads of charcoal, so we'll perhaps make some more drying racks later on. Okay, so let's set off. We've got plenty of meals. Our thermal stone is actually quite cold, so let's, let's just let a little bit of heat get into that. I've, over the night, What on earth was that? Well, I'm sure we'll find out fairly soon. Okay, during the night I made myself another fire pit and I've got that stored ready to use. Uh, 
Okay, that's making me nervous now. That's a very slowly deflating monster by the sounds of it. Well, I suppose we will find out what it is when it tries to eat us. Okay, so yeah, we're heading east. Um, I wanted to check to make sure that I had a hammer. I could make a hammer. Right, you're going to need to prototype a hammer before we leave, so let's do that quickly. We've lost half the day already because of that strange sound. Right, so... Hammer. We need some rope for that. So it's a good thing we went and got all that to glass, isn't it? Okay, and then that will allow us to make a hammer. Okay, and we'll use that to get the pig heads. Oh, that's making me nervous <laughs> now. <laughs> oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. Okay, so we've got plenty of warmth. Our earmuffs are about to go, but that doesn't matter because we've got another set that we can put on immediately. Getting a little bit hungry. Oh, there we go. Right. Where's my hammer? There it is. So, in all fairness, the pig's not using it anymore. So, we'll take those that's a lot of things we can make out of the pig skin. There's some decent armor. And also there's a backpack which will slow us down, but um, will also uh, allow us to carry much more. But as we've got Chester, I probably don't want that at the moment. Ooh. Ooh. In fact, let's have the bushes as well. That was a good find. No petals up here, unfortunately, no. And we are going to have to start heading back to base, or we're going to freeze fairly soon. Let's go sell us a little bit more wood on the way past. Uh, don't he seem to be hearing anything from the congestion monster just now. Sanity isn't going down much faster than it needs to be. Let's just check the map to make sure. Yeah, we filled out that space now. I suppose there's a small chance there's some flowers up there, but I don't think we're going to see them. And I think we are just going to have to accept the fact that we are not going to be raising our sanity any more this winter, which actually might not necessarily be a bad thing. We'll see. Okay, so back to base go no not drop not drop use utilize there we go right that's a, a bit of heat let's just let that put a little bit of heat in our thermal stone I think we've got time there we go right let's go and grab these oh was that the end of that one Okay, I think we've still got enough grass to, to make another trap. I think that might actually be our last one as well this winter. But I think we've got more than enough resources to keep us through until spring now. When unfortunately these rabbit holes all close up anyway. Because the game will give us berries back but will take the the uh, the meat resources away from us which is I, I suppose fair don't know what the rabbits are doing down there but given the fact that they're rabbits I can probably guess right a bit more fire there we go nice bit of warmth let's give ourselves a bite to eat because we're getting a touch hungry there great and we'll pick up the, the, the dry food in the morning. Let's put away that pig skin 
and we'll find a use for that in the next episode, I should imagine. So, until then, I've been Simon Parsons, this has been Don't Starve. Thank you, and good night.